In some areas, it just looked like somebody took their hand and just swiped all the houses down. Retired Deputy Fire Chief Terry Ott was one of the first on scene of the 1999 tornado, destroying parts of Montgomery and Blue Ash. He helped with search and rescue on Cornell Road. It was just unbelievable. And, you know, the, the initial shock of seeing that, it's like, where do you start? Homes on Cornell Road have been rebuilt and families have recovered. But 25 years later, nature is still healing. We always just assume nature is going to rebound and resurge and be okay. Dr. Teresa Colley is a professor of plant biology at the University of Cincinnati. She led UC's long-term study on the UC Benedict Nature Preserve, damaged in that storm. This tree likely was taken out by the tornado. Those studies found forests can regenerate after huge storms, but they tend to have fewer native species and more invasive species. And then at the top of that tree, that's a bad plant, that's an invasive, that's called garlic mustard. Volunteer and student groups periodically visit the preserve to remove invasive species like honeysuckle. This is um, where we have the end of Johnson Nature Preserve. So you can see there's a whole bunch of honeysuckle, larger honeysuckle. And then as we progress over into the UC Benedict Nature Preserve, you could see a lot less honeysuckle. Dr. Cully says the fewer invasive species, the more native plants, which keep animals in the habitat healthier. She says you find more invasive species in urban preserves because people have invasive ground cover in their gardens. When it stays in the yard, it's a great plant, but you can see it creeps out into natural areas and it forms these mats. And so that could be a problem. In cases like this, it's slowing down recovery. You have to do a better job of educating. While the people have rebuilt, Dr. Cully says nature's recovery could be studied for decades to come. Reporting in Montgomery, Chelsea Sick, Local 12 News. To get more stories from the Weather Authority and Local 12 News, go ahead and tap subscribe so that you can get notifications and get updates instantly.